Robert de la Salle by Owen Ion Aradia and Quam. Robert Cavalier Sieur de Salle was born in Rouen, France in 1643 by Jean Cavalier and Catherine Geist. As a young man, La Salle planned to enter the priesthood, but found himself unsuited to the life. At the age of 24, he followed his brother, also Jean Cavalier, to Canada, where he entered the fur trade. He wanted to explore the sea, so King Louis XIV sponsored his expedition in 1666. La Salle tried to bend others to his will and often demanded too much of them, though he was no less hard on himself. He did not have enough money to go on his expedition, so he borrowed money from his finance. Then he set sail for gold and silver. He found a piece of land in 1682 and called it Louisiana after King Louis. And he also founded a colony on what is now the coast of Texas. He explored the Great Lakes region of the United States and Canada and he claimed the Mississippi River for France. One day in 1687, his men were starving, so he set out for help. He died in Texas, shot dead at Point Blank Range by Pierre Duhat. He was killed at 43 years old because his own men thought he was crazy. Duhat was shot and killed by James Himes to avenge La Salle. Over the following week, others were killed. Confusion followed as to who killed Wolf. One of his main goals was to find the Northwest Passage. He never accomplished this goal because of his death. At that time, people thought it existed, then people found out it did not exist. Another one of his achievements was becoming one of the first European explorers to make alliances with the Native Americans of Arkansas. In conclusion, La Salle was a great explorer and nobleman, and was one of the few explorers at peace with Native Americans. He had many achievements and was one of the most noted explorers of the day. He will never be forgotten.